Then you can traditionally bolo from belly heba, knocking him on his back, rotating through, hitting his uh, knee behind your shin, being able to elevate him, take his back, it's like as slow as I can do it, Nogi. But it's usually typically done like a knockover and then a rotation, right? The other kind of variation we have is like a twister hook. Now watch this, this is my left leg to his left leg. So I'm over here like this. You guys see what I'm talking about? I can even be triangle, but essentially it's still my left leg. And I roll looking towards his hips, and I can either stop by at the truck, or I can come to the back. And there's, so there's those two types of rolling back takes that way. And this one is just slightly different, okay? It looks more like the twister hook version. So I'm here, and then again, I'm gonna look towards the feet and the hips. Do not look towards the head, you'll get your head crushed and cramped, and you'll make that person roll over your head. I don't want my head to never get touched. Like you can think about doing this on the street. Am I going to? No, but I'm just saying, think about it being concrete and I don't get hurt. Okay, so now this one is a little bit different in the sense that I'm gonna wanna take both my feet and put them right next to Nate's head. Okay, and you'll see what I'm talking about. So I roll over here, I'll just cover his hips a little bit and I come over here and it's like I'm going parallel with him and my feet come right next to his head. You guys see that? Look familiar? Haven't done it once since I taught you last, have you? Uh, okay, I'm just teasing, I'm just teasing, Jesus, ladies. So, <laughs> so, like, it's imperative that my knees are pinched and my femurs are pointing straight up. If I lean towards him like this at all, you can kick. No, 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 that way. Yeah, he's got back exposure that way, you know? So, like, I don't, I don't want my knees to go one way or the other. My femurs are vertical. So, not my knees, but my, my femurs are vertical. Try not to stop him in the face. This guy can just T-Rex, don't reach over the back for now. And I want you to take both of your feet and try to plant him as if he's on his back, right here next to him, next to his head, next to his shoulders. Okay, so I'm here and I just roll through and I stomp, okay? So now it's super important. You guys see how I was knee caught? And my thighs are pinching like I was before. My knees are not away from him. See how his knee starts to rotate and do all that? It's the same principle as when we were in side control. This knee's trying to touch his stomach. See, my knees are pinching. Uh, I guess it's not my knee in this case, so I end up being like the side of my thigh, but I have contact with his belly. You see what I'm saying? So then now, I'm gonna wanna take his hip and this one around his neck, right? When I do that, I'll just rotate my knees a little bit. It'll elevate his hip. You guys see how it elevates his hip? And I wanna get this grip right here. Okay, it's important that I do that and then I rotate back. Watch, there's my right leg can come out and I go, I'm on his back. And this is important because I don't want him to, I'll show you what I'm talking about in a second. I'm here, knees tight, feet tight, I rotate over. I don't want Nate to, if I turn too far, to sit all the way to twist his side. Look, he's already got a back hook and all that stuff. So, you know what I mean? I'm in a compromised position. So I don't want him to sit through. So it's important that I'm like here, I roll through, I control, I've got my, my femur straight up, and then for a second I rotate out and I'm already like, all right, so even if you slightly try to come over, I'm gonna go, nope. All right. Here, rotate, stomp, rotate my shoulders. Okay. You can either turn it into a heel hook, right here, boom, boom. Make sense? Mm -hmm. Okay, one more time, on the ground, step. Close, I move my foot, get my knee over the top, kick the heel hook off, adjust my position. Settling down if I need to, put weight on. Remember we got the darts and stuff like that too. But I turn, feet go next to his shoulders. Femurs are straight up. Here's the rocking motion, his hips on me. And this will pull his body over, you see? So like, just a little bit. Shoulder and hip. Now watch my left hook. My right leg will come out, my left hook comes in. Just climb a ladder. There we go. The, yeah, that's the detail. It's gonna be hard for y'all to pick up when we do that right there. All right, let's show it a couple more times. Master Sensei Thunder. Mm -hmm. So you need to see it again. 
Oh, no, uh, Pastor Sensei or Pastor Sensei? Oh, you can pick one. We're over here in Christian Oklahoma. We probably <laughs> Pastor Sensei too. I like that. <laughs> Post. Thank <laughs> you.